Welcome back with Mr. Broccoli. Hey, y'all already know what time it is. We back for another one. So what we have here is inside we have a CFL light. We have two CFL lights. We have a LED bulb. Um, we have an exhaust fan. We'll pull clean air in fan and exhaust out fan at the top. We have each one at the corner to give out more, more air circulation. So the plants are always breathing fresh air. So what we're going to do today is we're going to get this ready for a hydroponic setup. So the first thing we did, we took some rocks in there. This is all good rocks. You want to clean them off. You want to use that as your base. You just want to use that as your base. You might got holes in your net pot. Or you could be used like me and using a regular pot and put extra holes in it. So once you do that from that point, what you want to do is you want to put your germinated seed in the rock wall as careful as possible. And then you want to test it out to see how deep your rock wall goes inside. So my rock wall is a little too deep. I want it to about that level. So I will have to put some more rocks and hydroton in. So we'll put more rocks and hydroton in. And these little pebbles here are called hydroton. They're clay pellets. They hold water very efficiently. They're great. These rocks are just normal rocks here. You can get these from your local hardware store. Hydroton, you want to get that from your local hydroponic store, Amazon, and other online sites, retail. So we're gonna put a little bit more in. We're trying to get to the right amount that we need. And that's just a little too much. So what we're gonna do, we're gonna take a couple out, shake it up again, stick it back in, and now we have the perfect height. You keep this paper around your rock wall. I've done it without the paper and with the paper. Um, with the paper your roots grow straight down into the reservoir um, you take this little white paper off of it and your roots will grow everywhere but down they'll grow down eventually but it'll grow everywhere else to the left right just every fucking way and you really want your rock wall to be like your bulb <coughs> so for me we can do just gonna fill this up and before you put your seed in your rock wool you want to pH test it make sure the pH is just the right amount so it doesn't kill the seeds or stunt the growth of the seed from that point I'm just gonna put hydroton all around it trying to fill up the gaps and at this current moment we're not covering it we want the seed to be able to sprout and come through with no hesitation nothing stopping it from doing what we need it to do what we want it to do so that's that so this is already ready to go and ready to be put in so next thing we're going to do we're going to fill our deep water bucket up and we have the water that we ph and the water is is at a perfect perfect six point so that's just the right amount we need I'm gonna put this down for a second pour the water in and we'll go from there well first thing we're gonna do before we pour the water in we are going to get our Our airline tubing this is the flexible line tubing this is the smaller one so what we're gonna do is gonna set that in the bucket like so only thing we're gonna do is disconnect it from the from this to make a top so we can put it in through the top uh, so I have the top here somewhere uh -huh. Now this is the top ladies and gentlemen I put two holes in it as you can see and you put your two holes in it run your airline through there
So we got the air hoses in like so. We have two air hoses in. So as we have the air hoses in, what we're gonna do is we're gonna start to back this in so. So that's there. And now we're gonna pour the water in here as soon as we get our airline plugged up. So we'll be right back. So we have one airline hooked up and ready to go. We're getting ready to hook the second one up as soon as I can find the air diffuser. So we have a cylinder air diffuser. We're gonna set that right in the middle. So we're gonna build a lot of a lot of air, a lot of oxygen going straight to the root, straight to the rock wool, providing all the oxygen and nutrients that it need to take off and grow. So now we have the diffuser on, we have everything all together. We're just gonna pour the water in, and then we'll go from there. So when you're doing this, you wanna fill up your reservoir up to not touching the net pot, but like right under the net pot. And folks who's watching Mr. Broccoli grow, I'm teaching you how to do hydroponics. I don't know if you can see this water or not, but this water is not a dark color. It's very clear looking. It almost has like a gold champagne color. And this is a telltale sign how you know you don't have too much chemicals in. It looks just right. And remember, every time you add a chemical into your water, Make sure you stir it, you mix it, just in case I didn't tell you guys that in the last video. So now that we have everything plugged up and ready to go, we'll be putting the top on now. And now with the top being on, what we want to do is we want to get our airline, our air tube into the exact spot we want it. So, well, the most basic thing to do is just to pull it. Um, stick your hand in there, move it around with your hand to get it in the right position that you would like. Um, once you have it in the right position, that you want, everything's all set. So we're going to go ahead and put it in our little tent that we made. So we'll slide it in like so. Slide it into the back as much as possible. <coughs> so that's what it looks like. So now basically all you're gonna do is you're gonna take your net pot, set it right in there in the hole. But before we do that, we're gonna turn everything on and show you what it looks like. So folks, we have an air pump here. And you want to make sure you hook your air pump to your lines and make sure you get it um make sure that you get a stopper so water doesn't run back into your air pump create electrical fire which could be hazardous for you and could potentially mean death so always be careful when you're dealing with hydroponics and the air pump and electricity and lights with all inside growing you need to be very 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 careful and thoughtful about what you do how you do it and how it's going to be executed and what it's going to look like in the long run all right folks 
So now the lights on. We have a full operating grow. We have our exhaust fans working. All fans are as on and working like supposed to. Um, we are creating bubbles. You see, we have two type of bubbles, and I'm gonna show you real quick, folks, so that you can see exactly what I was talking about in one of my videos before with Mr. Broccoli, and I was telling you guys basically how the cylinder one. Spits out bubbles, but as you can see, let's see if I can get you a better picture down here. The little one is making little, small, beautiful bubbles, and then when I stick her in, she just makes beautiful, beautiful bubbles. So that is really good, really, really good. Okay. So everything's done, we're getting a nice popping sensation. The water's popping up like it's supposed to. It's just gonna hit the rock wall and everything's gonna be nice and fine. Good, good oxygen in there, water. Everything's running fine and great. So basically now we're gonna take house seedling, which is ready. And we'll just Drop right on in there. And she'll sit like that. All the water and anything will pop up on her. And walked on hydroponics. Now the real fun begins. Thanks for watching. Thanks for riding it out. This has been a very, very good beginning. But now we have come to the fun part we've come to the fun part of of growing now we did the design we have did the build we've talked about chemicals and mixing chemicals organic non-organic we have also talked about airlines bubblers um we talked about a lot intro into hydroponics So I'll be updating you guys with another video in the next two to three weeks. Stay looking for the video. Until then, get high, smoke good, fuck good, and so many other things. But do it all while you high. Mr. Broccoli out, bitches.